NBC 15 News starts now. Hello and thank you for joining NBC 15 News on the web. Here's a look at the stories we're following for you today. The Assembly will now vote on the right to work bill next week. The state Senate passed the bill last night with a 17 to 15 vote. Senator Jerry Petroski of Marathon was the only Republican who did not vote in favor of the bill. The bill also did not see any Democratic votes. Right to work laws prohibit unions from reaching labor deals with businesses that require workers pay fees to the union. In developing news, a fire broke out at the Capitol Center apartments on the 300 block of West Dayton in downtown Madison. The call came in just before four this morning. The fire is completely out at this time and residents are now being allowed back into the building. No word on any injuries. A Fitchburg man is facing a first-degree reckless homicide charge in the death of his girlfriend's infant. 24-year-old Corey Holly was taken into custody Monday for a probation hold. Police and EMS were called to a home on Breckenridge Court. There, they found an unresponsive two-month-old. The infant was pronounced dead at the hospital. As a result of the investigation, Holly was booked in the Dane County Jail. The Dane County Medical Examiner's Office is investigating the exact cause of death. That's a look at the stories we're following for you today. Join us again on the web for midday headlines. Have a wonderful Thursday.